imperative that things appear as normal here. Keep an eye on Sergio in case he gets tempted to blow the whistle. Thanks. I'll do that. You're going to overlook my little immigration problem, aren't you? Cheer up, fatso. We're gonna let you go on squeezing these poor saps a little while longer. Well, until some commie union types infiltrate this place. Great. I am glad to be out of that place. I never knew fresh vegetables could smell so bad. Ooh, keep doing that. Mm, wait, why is this though? I guess we'll yeah, we'll have to come back, right? They catch um catch them in the act of canning uh canning the marijuana. At least I hope. But for now, let's go uh, see what's going on in the 20th century market. Why they're buying so much soup. How many years have you been in Vice, Roy? Mm. Look where you're going! Shut up. How long you been in Vice? More years than I want to own up to, Phelps. You have any idea who Rojas was talking about? The gringo runs the operation? It could be anybody. You don't expect those morons to be running the show, do you? If you ask Rojas how much a silver dollar is worth, he'd probably say 50 cents. What the hell? Sorry. <laughs> what am I saying? I'm not sorry. Fuck your car. Fuck you. <laughs> out of my way! Hey, you who just turned in, out of the way! Sit tight. Let's take a look at what's going on. Either these customers are serious soup lovers, or I think we found our middleman. Car 11 King to KGPL. Car 11 King, go ahead. I'm requesting assistance in a B wagon at 20th Century Markets, 1558 North Highland. Numerous narcotic suspects. Code 2 only, no sirens. 11K, roger. Okay. Cavalry should be here any minute. Damn. All right. LAPD, nobody move! I'll take my chances. Oh, fuck you. Every time. Heck you, you son of a bitch. Oh, come on. Oh, come on. Uh, let's get him. Get him, 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 get him. Yeah, fuck you. Whatever you're carrying, hand it over. Hmm. I'd say he's got about half a can left. I guess that makes me a pessimist. You can't Fuck take me that. in. <laughs> take you in? Be glad he didn't shoot you. I wouldn't have chased you. If it was up to me, you'd be talking out of a hole in the back of your I head. I want information. Senor, I would like to help you. But I got a family in Mexico I have to provide for. And my compadres are very unreasonable. Your compadres? Turn out your pockets. I know they're going to run down these silver dollars. I need to make a deal. I need guarantees. You have identification? Sanchez Erto, Mexican, Tijuana address.
Couple dollars, okay. Here's the deal, Erto. You give me information, and I won't give you to immigration. Give me EJ, the driver bringing in the shipments, or I'll make you for it. I run this shop. That's all I do. No, no, it's not. You have a coin. You're part of the operation. Tell me the goddamn truth. You are in this with the others. I told you I know them. I told you my family's at risk. What makes me part of their gang? Mm, the coin. You have a silver dollar, Erto, just like Juan. I'm sure Ernesto and the rest have them as well. The silver dollars are his mark. Whose? Give me a name. None of us are allowed to see him. His creatures carry his orders to us. If I gave you his name, I would be buried alongside my wife and children. If you don't give us something, you will rot in jail while your family starves on the street. Ernesto Juarez, tonight at 1 a.m. He's bringing the truck into the soup factory. Please help me, sir. Ernesto can be very cruel. Hmm. We are going back. Tell me about the soup cans. The soup is very popular, as you can see. <laughs> yeah, why is it so popular? It's real funny, wise guy. You want to try saying that again with no teeth? I get a delivery at 7.30 every other day from the factory. Jorge organizes everything. We know about Jorge and Juan. Juan is dead. Tell us how you know the Cruz boys. Ernesto put together this thing. He brought in Juan, Juan brought in Jorge. Mm. I mean, that seems legit. Sounds about right. And you don't seem to be lying, so. Okay. Continue. I was already here. Ernesto knows I'm illegal, so he threatened to report me if I didn't help. And the money is good. The gringos and the gringas, they love the reefer. And I didn't want to have to leave and start again in San Francisco. You're breaking my heart. You're under arrest, Erto. I'll speak to the DA and see if he will agree to not seize your assets or deport you. That's the best I can do. Freddy said they were moving 50 pounds a week. That's a lot of soup cans. I think this is an interstate operation. Moving dope around the country to selected grasshoppers. Local weed gets distributed in the usual way, through Pachuco street punks. Someone must know something about this drug baron character. Here they come. Let him unload the goods first. Now? Let's get him. Wow. Open your eyes! Uh. All right, move. Move! Let's go! Everyone into position. Perimeter is up. The whole place is contained. Going hard. LAPD, put your hands where we can see them. Weapons on God the damn it. Go, Get in there. Yeah, I got him. Hey, who the fuck? No. Find some cover. Yeah, fuck you. Take cover, you lunatic. Oh. Come on. Ow. Boom.
Is that your arm right there? No. Come on, Cole. I'm wide open here. Where the fuck? God damn it. I think that's the last of them, Cole. Good. Too many. Detectives. Found something here you probably want to see. Okay. Hmm. Hey, that's a dollar. One dollar per dead man. Doesn't seem like much for a human life. Tijuana address. We should see what the Federales have on it. You have grass? Yeah, just a ticket. Mm, nothing. I doubt your face has anything. Mm, okay. God damn. I think we found our stash, Cole. Take a look in these boxes. Oh shit. At the very minimum, another 50 pounds. Detectives, I think we got the guy. Does the name Cruz mean something to you? It certainly does. Where is he? Upstairs? Get out of my way. You're too slow. You grabbed a can? Oh no, that's money. Holy shit. Must be a thousand dollars here. Hey. Yet another silver dollar. Phelps, Earl. Looks like quite a bloodbath. What was this all about? Drugs and money. What else? Speaking of money. Where did that roll go? I picked it up for safekeeping. The department owes me 50. Ray, I have another two coins for you. Great. I've got something to show you. It's all set up on the table over here. There. Take a look at these coins you've been collecting. There are letters cut into each coin, along with not legal tender. What does it mean? Those are Morgan silver dollars from the 20s. They were removed from circulation and sent for disposal. A number of smelters around the country had the contract. Look at them together. Can you work out what it says? Uh, metal. The first coin, MAS. The second, ANG. The third, KAY. The fourth, MET. The fifth, ALS, Mesanke Metals. A metal foundry. Would you like the address? Would I ever? 1034 Vine Street, Hollywood. We'll finish up here. It's already been a long night, Phelps. See if you can talk them into giving themselves up. Somehow I, uh, I doubt that. We done here? Oops. 
we are. The Masanke medals then. Oh, you piece of shit. Get in. I hope that big wad of cash doesn't weigh you down. It's your priority, straight Phelps. We're close to bringing in one of the biggest dope cases of the year, and you're worrying about unsubstantial evidence? Man, go fuck yourself. Oh wow, it's right the fuck here. Can we try not to kill any Sorry. Locked. We need another way in. Hmm. This way? Oh, yep. Yep, that'll work. I'm not Roy. Wow. This shit is abandoned. Ooh. Is this anything? A reason to be up here. Doesn't look like it. Okay, well, uh, it was probably yeah. It's another way to get in. You climb up that, and you climb down this. Okay. There's more. Sorry about that, friend. How the fuck? Oh, stairs. You okay? I'll tell you when I see what's waiting for us at the top. Shit. Oh, fuck. stairs and more people <laughs> my fucking hat dude pick it up where is it no fuck Sanders. You know this guy? I should have known. Of course I know Roy. Roy and I have had an arrangement for Get many up. years. You're under arrest. Am I? This we have a mountain of prima facie evidence, as well as the testimony. You'd be surprised how things have a habit of sorting themselves out. Evidence disappearing. Witnesses that can't be found. Policemen that forget. 
The impossible becomes probable when you have a client list like mine. Shut your mouth! Turn around and put your hands behind your back. Working vice can be a thankless task, Phelps. But on behalf of the brass and the moms and dads and the concerned citizens, I'd like to commend you and your partner for smashing this dope ring. Reefer is almost as big a threat to the children of this city as communism. What about Sanders, Lieutenant? Leave Sanders to me, Phelps. The chief will be looking after that one personally. He will be brought to trial. Phelps, we are celebrating your success. Don't push your luck. Sanders is no longer your problem. Great. Awesome. Just let him get away. Okay. 13 out of 13 clues found. 9 out of 9 questions correct. A bunch of vehicle damage to Roy and some random people. 50 injury for that guy I ran over. And 38 of the random benches and mailboxes I broke. Even without Victor Sanders, the Parnell soup pot bust is guaranteed to go down in LABD history. Fantastic. Your platoon is what remains of recon. I'm folding you into the 22nd. You'll be going up that damn hill tonight. We're intelligence gathering, sir. I don't need intelligence, son. I need men who can hold rifles and kill Japs. Tonight, you're a rifle company. We've got cooks, mechanics, and stretcher bearers all going into the line. We aim to break them tonight, Lieutenant. Good to see you, Hank. You too, Cole. How's your war? Not quite what I expected. As long as I live, I will never get over that sound. Hey, who's that medic? He'll be killed going out there. It's Sheldon, the guy from the Alcacala Bridge. That guy's got no fear. <laughs> He didn't make it. I didn't go out there to save him. What are you saying, man? I went out there to put him out of his misery, to ease his pain. Do you have a problem with that? Murder, Corman. That's war, Lieutenant. Smell the stench. Feel the horse breath on your neck. You need help, man. Call for me tonight, Lieutenant. When you're up on that hill. I've been up there three times already. The circles of hell have nothing on Sugarloaf Hill. Get this madman out of my sight! <laughs> 